Welcome back. David Diggs and girlfriend Emmy Raver Lampman expecting their first child. The Little Mermaid actor and the Umbrella Academy actress have taken to Instagram to show off pictures from a recent maternity picture where they are seen laughing and kissing. David Diggs is to be a father for the first time. The Little Mermaid 2023 actor and his partner Emmy Raver Lampman have taken to Instagram to show off pictures from a recent maternity shoot in which the 41-year-old star laughed and kissed the Umbrella Academy actress as they both held her bump. They captioned the joint post, We can't wait to meet you, heart emoji, sick. The couple met in 2015 when they were both part of the original Broadway cast of Hamilton with David Klein, Marquis de Lafayette and Thomas Jefferson and 35-year-old beauty part of the ensemble and their friendship turning romantic a few years later. In March 2021, the usually private couple appeared on the cover of Architectural Digest together to talk about their Mandy Cheng design home in California and admitted it was at the center of their plans to build a life together. Emmy said, this may be our first house together, but I already see us and our families and our community and our passions everywhere I look, David added. Having a home like this definitely makes it harder to be away. Now, I really understand what it means to miss home because there is really no other place I want to be. The Snowpiercer actor recently discussed his concerns for the future of the world amid climate change. He told the Independent, the kinds of weather we are experiencing now are different than any point in the rest of my life and you become aware that that means something. It's the thing I think about. I think we're at a pretty critical moment in terms of the discussions of where we go with the way we treat the planet. We could start by prioritizing the climate and maybe that will help us have a different future. We don't know what that is. I think there's no way to predict how far gone we already are, but it doesn't have to be like that. Thanks for listening.